All right. So we got Bill's Marsh. No, I mean Queso's Marsh versus Bill's Falco, which is kind of on the come up. I wouldn't really call it a come up because it hasn't come up very far. But um, it's okay. Here we see uh, Queso doing what he does best. Um, he beats Falcos. Look at him just wait for the platform. What happened? Okay. Sorry guys, we don't really fucking need to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Guido. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. As we continue the match, uh, Bill's Falco is missing wave lanes on the platforms. And somehow killing Queso's Mirth. I don't know how that happened. You may say this commentary is biased, but... I didn't even set it up yet. Queso <laughs> is that one. Now we're actually set up um, into the, the matchup we call Bill's Falco. It's just getting kind of exploited right now, getting pressured at the ledge. Okay, so it just looks like he knows what Bill's gonna do on the platform, just kind of waits for the option. Forest match just like cleaning up garbage stock. I think Queso's just looking for a straight hit here just to knock him right off stage and just like pick him up. Bill's kind of turning it up. I don't know where this came from. I've never seen this before. But as I say that, the fire is slowly dying out. Bill resorted to camping and getting clipped by Queso. It. Grab waits for the spot dodge, pretty cool. That's how you know he was ready. And Queso just kind of did it to him. Really expected of this uh, Swiffle Marthman. Alright, so I think the effective counter pick here is probably going to be Yoshi's. I hope they go stadium because then they probably would have fun at the matchup. I know Queso probably banned Dreamland. Ready? And they go Yoshi's and he switches to Sheik. Well, isn't this a shocker? Now, much like the result of the first game, Queso is winning the second one. Um, a quick 10 second stock um, leaves Bill at a mere 3 stocks and his winner's bracket life. Alright, kind of cleans it up, just needs one more hit to secure it off stage. Now, I can't really count Bill out, because he showed a little bit of sauce, but I think Queso has the Chick-fil-A sauce, while um, Bill has Big Mac sauce. Okay. Okay, so with these clean, kind of clean movements, just the spacing around really well and flipped off stage. Resorting to the forward smash, grabs the ledge. Alright, up tilt, good coverage. Alright, Forest. I think what Bill needs to do right now, he needs to get some, some space, needs to get some needles out, has to have some stage dominance. Holding center pretty well right now. Alright, 
Didn't do much other than that shield. Alright. Let's see how Keso gets back on. Kinda just slid back on. Bill kinda called that out. Keso's just kinda losing the stops to himself right now. Alright. Grabs the ledge safe. Has the stage. Alright. Alright, Bill's starting to create some stage controls. Finally throwing out some needles. Just kind of taking this game away from him. I'm surprised. I thought he was staying Falco. Alright. Poor smash, alright. Now this can happen, but he's going to have to be very, very concerned with these, these forward airs and forward tilts. Because that's all Bill has to do to close it out. Look at that, there's a tilt, there's a fair. Look at that. We're going to game three? Question mark? No, Bill doesn't want to win yet. There he is. Alright, 1-1. One, one. What's Bill going to play this time? If he goes back to Falco, I'm going to be concerned for his winner's life bracket. If he stays chic, it just honestly depends on the stage. Because if Queso takes it back and he doesn't SD, I think we can do it. I think Bill just has to play consistent. I think Bill needs to Ready? stay chic, which was a smart move by him. Right. There. Pretty good coverage. I think um, maybe a little bit closer, enough like threatening presence. Just like fade back a little bit so needles can't get thrown out. Moving pretty fast, honestly. Alright, we got the Nair into the forward smash. Alright, that was pretty smart. Just a little slow on the timing. Bill's doing a really good job of just holding the center stage, just staying ground and not losing his stuff. Alright, just like staying around in that little like corner area of the stage into the fair. Waited a little bit for a DI mix up. Back here, that should seal it. Now you're gonna see this gameplay start to slow down. You know, both of them definitely want to win. Just who's gonna slow down and play smart control? Alright, there you go. Case of baited out the grab. This is just a patience match. Alright, waits for the spot dodge. Case of doing a lot of waiting. Alright, forward smash, just waiting for his reactions out of the shield. This is pretty smart. Bill's just trying to match him right now. Just trying to contain some space. Case is all over. Fair, alright. Let's see if we can grab the ledge. Ooh. Oh, we're both pretty quick. Alright. After all that Marth neutral, just one exchange and Bill takes the lead. Alright. It's been down this whole half. Alright. Forward smash. Alright, now you gotta grab the ledge. Nice. Now we got an even game three set. Yeah. Bill and Queso. Foolishly, Bill went Falco game one and it didn't go well. But now we're here. So, dude. Queso takes the fucking lead of game three. Let's fucking go, Queso. Does he save the jump? He always saves his fucking jump. Look at this man's. 
as we have some bracket updates, uh, we're looking at winners round three, GDP and Spency, and the winner of um, Queso and Quad A will play off against Schmang. I thought you were Bill. I was like, that fast? We're doing good. We're looking at this intense game three where Marth just died. And a 15% lead is what's separating Bill and Queso right now from this winner's round three spot. I think Sheik wins this, and I think Case was playing this uphill ba battle pretty stoically as he hits this very fair tipper. 69%. And he grabs the ledge. How smart! Keisu's a genius, as he wins 